So it's probably a free kick in here. So Carlton on the verge of a big victory here at Amy Stadium. And they'd want to. They've got a tough draw to come. Geelong, Collingwood and St Kilda for the next three that's weeks. Man, Doesn't get much yeah, tougher than it. that in Play season off. 2010. Houlihan again, surely not for his fourth. He loads up. It won't have the distance, but Henderson uncontested. Half a dozen crows just watch that. And Lockie Henderson, a chance to go back and add to the pain for Adelaide. Hey, that draw is pretty interesting, Kelly. That's, 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 that's a tough draw, isn't it? Geelong at the G, Collingwood at the G, and then St Kilda at Eddie Had. Cool. As Henderson just strolls on in elementary and continues the torment. So I must say that um, one of the things we're forgetting about in the new rule changes, Tim, was that the mark in the goal square actually goes straight back now. Not that long ago, you'd go back on the angle. So those sort of marks that he took then would have been on an angle. And so occasionally you missed them. Now you don't, of course. So goal kicking's actually probably even worse than what we really think it is from a few years ago. Good point, Malcolm. Thank you. Blown out now, and Adelaide with another tough one next week, a trip to Melbourne for the Bulldogs, then the, the Derby, then the Tigers, which is a winnable game, and then a trip to Melbourne for the Kangaroos. Brett Ratton with a the month from wow. hell in front of him, but this wow. is a good start. A morale boosting win over Adelaide in hostile Pinch territory. Guys, Tigers now, round up. seven, it could be two winless sides heading into that blockbuster, Tim. Well, the Tigers have got Melbourne before this weekend's out, so you never know. I mean, if they could win one of those, they'd be three and three, Carlton. And after, well, that'd be right. No, they'd be three and four, wouldn't they? So not out of it. Tough games ahead, though. This is uh, a really difficult phase of their draw. Maritz to tap. He's got hold his own. Danger field over the ball. Kick. A free kick to Adelaide. And quick movement here. Vince pumping it in. Jamison the spoil on Thompson. White taking it away for the Blues to Carrazzo. And Henderson, I've liked Henderson's last quarter. He's worked up the ground. And he knows when to put the ball overhead too, just to soak up a bit of time, lest that 49-point lead be jeopardised. A tricky slam down thing. White the boot of one foot on the back of the other calf, perhaps. It's got to be high, though, for, for maximum visibility, doesn't it? Yeah. Bit of a dance. Yeah. Here goes Thompson. Burton there, Jamison with him. He's a good defender, Jamison. Douglas arrives for Adelaide. Keeps it alive. Burton, impossible angle there. Petrenko being taken further and further from goal. Now out to the 50. Simon Goodwin from outside the arc. Quick kick to Doughty. Couldn't hang on. And the Blues are able to sweep it away. Simpson. In front of the interchange gates, Garlett in a foot race with oh. McLeod. Well, nearly kept it in play. Not quite. Malcolm, no team has made the finals after losing the first four since the introduction of that top eight system in 1995. Any hope whatsoever here? No. Thank you. What's one team that went Norton for a long time ago, apparently? Let me guess. It involved you. <laughs> oh, I'd forgotten that. Someone mentioned that, Sam. You, you just told me that. 1975 <laughs> North Melbourne. Was it really? It was. Wow. Zero and four. Wow, what a good, must have been a good team. You good turn coaching. it around. Perhaps you need to go in midweek and uh, you could tell them your story and that would inspire them. Mm. For pleasure. Late to salvage something not to be. Well... It's not impossible then, is it? I mean, just because it hasn't been done before doesn't mean it's not possible. This team, though, really does seem to be in trouble. It's it's lost something, it seems, between seasons. Someone talked about mojo. You lose your mojo as a team. Can you, can you help me out with that, Tim? That's a really different... How can that be so... I don't understand that. You don't know what a mojo is? No, I've, I've looked it up in the dictionary and I can't find it. It's what Adelaide have lost. Ah, right. Who's, can you find them? Can you go to the shop and buy another one? Yes, mojos <laughs> can be found. Okay. But sometimes 
You've got to look long and hard. Ah. Scotland for the Blues to Simpson. Just called Fillington. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing an outstanding job. Uh, There's not long to go. Those of you watching and listening will be pleased to know. Carlton's footy down the back. Murphy, that famous number 43, being worn by Simon White. It's been all right, too. Kuda Fetty's ringing Thursday night to say congratulations and enjoy. So Kuda's still involved. Malcolm, Simpson. it strikes me that Adelaide have been doing the same thing for a long time under Neil Craig. It hasn't quite got them there, and perhaps that's Thanks really God. dawned on the players. They've worked long and hard, and at some point or other, when you're doing that and there's no sign of anything new, and this isn't to blame the coach, it has a lot to do with cattle, you must start to wonder, are you ever going to get there? Yeah, that's true. I, I, I think the elusive goal and the elusive Come dream... On when you start losing becomes so it's like oh, in Mount Everest you know it's, it's almost impossible to believe the Blues running down the clock painful to watch for Crows fans Robinson sees it over Lucas has been really good in his second game this afternoon 25 touches including 10 marks and Robinson giving his all as he always does no holes boys no holes focus the footy it's the Blues by 48 points. Vince, short, just grubbers the kick to Davis. He'll be better for his first game. Walker, they share it around. Edwards, getting some late touches, adding to the stat sheet. Dangerfield, just an effort in itself to be out there this afternoon. And there's the siren to end the pain for the Adelaide Footy Club. The Blues season back on track. And the Crows season in crisis. Carlton's first win against Adelaide in eight encounters. So it ends some agony for the Blues. And they do it resoundingly by 48 points. Fox Sports presentation.